Hello YouTube, welcome back to my channel. It's your boy Momo from Dark Bobby Outcrops. And I just got a new trimmer right here. KMA 1971. I bought this for $16 from Wish.com and it delivered around a week and a half. So in this video, I'm gonna do a little bit of unboxing and a review and also testing out to see its performance. But before we're moving on to review, make sure to subscribe to my channel, give it a thumbs up, and share with your friends, and let's get started. Buzz. All right, so let's just get straight into the point. So basically, they sent me all this stuff in a tiny little box right here. I'm quite surprised that they sent me a box because they usually don't send me a box. But this time they did. Maybe that's why I pay, I'm paying a little bit extra compared to the previous purchases. But I actually appreciate this. It's a nice little box that I can collect. It's very nice. And yeah, so this is the main body of the trimmer. Let me focus it right here. On the side, it is, this is kind of like a snake skin. It's nice little design on the side. And the color is gold. You can see the logo right here, KMA. And this is a skeleton trimmer where you can see the motor like right here. You can see everything, skeleton stuff. All right, and on the bottom, there's a switch. You press it, it turns into blue. And I'm assuming that when the battery goes down, it turns into red or it just blinks so that you know the tremor is low on battery. And for the charging port, port, charging port they use a Type-C USB cable, which is quite exactly same as, let me, let me focus. Uh, with my phone or any other Android phones. It's pretty quite useful. You can charge your phone and your trimmer at the same time. It's a USB right here. And the USB cable also comes along with the box, so which is pretty quite handy. I like it. And the weight is not that heavy, but also not too light. So it's actually very nice. And the blaze is kind of small. But I'm gonna swap it later. So by the way, so I also purchased this uh, replacement uh, for, for the Tremor Blades. I'm going to test it out, see which one is better. Hopefully this one is good. This one is ceramic blade. See if it cuts sharp. And of course the instruction manual, it's written in English. I'm not going to go through all this. But yeah, let's just go into the performance. So yeah, stay tuned and boom. Does it hurt? No. Yeah. How do you feel? 